Hey guys, it's Shauna and Marissa and today's video is going to be crazy weird vagina facts. Yeah, yeah, we did a vagina facts video a few months ago and everyone really liked it. It was really interesting. It was really informative. Yeah, it was so weird. Like some of the facts, like some of the weird vagina facts were like, what? Like yeah. you would never know that type of stuff. So we decided to do another crazy weird vagina facts for you guys. These are even crazier. These are even crazier. Well, some of them are. I feel like <laughs> some of them aren't. Some of them are. Like it just depends because I feel like some of them are just really crazy. And make sure to smash this video a, a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Or as Chester likes to say, a panda thumbs up because the first 30,000 people who give this video a thumbs up, somebody will give you guys money. I don't know when, I don't know who, but Chester tells me that somebody will give y'all money. He is not joking, no joke y'all. Yeah. Um, and also subscribe if you're not already because that's how the magic works. You gotta subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you want Chester's magic to work. Yee. Oh, and could you guys help Marissa get to 70,000 Instagram we do it, followers? Can we do it? Seven's my lucky number, so 70 thou. Yeah. It's gonna be my number. My Insta is at Miss Marissa Rachel, and Shauna's is at Shauna underscore Lisa. If you guys want to follow us. Now, without further ado, Mr. Chester the Panda, let's get into these weird vagina facts. <laughs> So a doctor once removed a potato Ugh. from a girl's vagina because Ew. it had started sprouting like vines out of her vagina because her mother told her that it would prevent pregnancy. Like what, like sticking a potato? Yeah, out of her vagina the girl had pregnancy. a potato in her vagina. Isn't that crazy? That is so, and she couldn't just pull it out. It had to be removed by a doctor. It had to be. I guess it had like gotten wedged up there or something. That is like so that. Is that disgusting. so crazy? So yeah, I mean most mothers would just recommend like birth control or something like that But no this mother recommended a potato up the vagina. So disclaimer so guys do not put a potato up your vagina No french fries. No potato chips. <laughs> no Nothing potato. None of that. None of that. Don't do it guys. Don't oh, do gosh. it So the vagina produces up to two teaspoons a vaginal discharge per day um, but you just don't notice it because it gets like released very very slowly throughout the day okay so what you eat can actually affect how your vagina area smells which is crazy because I know that like that's supposed to affect the smell the scent of your pee but I didn't know that was also supposed to affect like the scent of your vagina isn't that crazy like I wonder what happens if you if it's like if you're a vegan if it smells different or if you eat like if you eat like fruits and vegetables. Apparently they recommend eating things like strawberries and pineapple if you want your vagina to smell good. So in some very rare cases, some women can be born with two vaginas. Two. Like that is so crazy. Like they'd have to put in like two tampons and everything. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And like, I wonder if you could like have babies, babies from both of them. Like, I don't know. I don't know. That I know that in some cases you can also have like one of the vaginas removed or something but I guess like for some you can't because I guess it's like not medically safe so that would be so crazy to have like two vaginas like I wonder if you would need to get like special underwear or like put two pads down or, I don't know I don't know but that sounds really interesting well I know there's a youtuber and I'm pretty sure her channel name is diamonds and heels and oh. she has two vaginas she has like a big video about it oh wow that's interesting yeah. so the largest vagina in the entire intergalactic universe that has been recorded was said to belong to a woman who was seven feet and eight inches tall and apparently she had a 26 pound baby I don't yeah. know if that's true or not but that's a really kind of that's a really big baby that's a that big so baby crazy. um 26 but, pounds yeah the exact dimensions of her vagina though were unknown but I that's that's fine with me I don't really <laughs> I don't really need to know exactly like the parameters the circumference of her vagina <laughs> I really do not need to know that but yeah if you guys were ever wondering who had the largest vagina she was over seven feet tall okay so your vagina is actually it's not straight up and down it's tilted at a 130 degree angle which is why when you're inserting a tampon you should point the tampon towards your lower back hmm. so that's not just straight up so it's like at an angle, basically. Yeah, at yeah. an angle pointing at your lower back. 
So your vagina has the same pH level as a glass of wine, and I didn't know what the heck pH level meant, but apparently it's like the level of acidity. So basically, your vagina is like as acidic as a glass of wine. That's kind of like a weird random fact or also a glass of beer. So that's so weird that like your vagina is as acidic as a glass of wine. That's crazy. I didn't even know any body parts of yours like could be acidic. Okay, so the older you are, the less likely you are to remove your pubic hair. So like for example, 18 to 24 year olds, they're the ones who are most likely to either like shave or wax or laser away their pubic hair. And then as you get older, I guess women just start like caring less. So mm -hmm. they, they just, they don't get rid of their pubic hair. So discharge, which is the clear, milky white, sometimes colored kind of sticky substance that comes out of your vagina that is usually like found on your underwear that changes throughout your period cycle so like before your period it will look a certain color and be a certain consistency on your period it's different and like pretty much throughout the month it'll vary based on like if you're on your period or not on your period and pretty much all of it's normal like I'll do another video just specifically talking about the colors and the textures and all that stuff of like vaginal discharge but basically unless it burns or is super itchy or is very very thick like cottage cheese looking um, then it's normal if it looks like one of those then go to the gynecologist or doctor immediately the longest female pubic hair ever measured was 28 inches long I don't know how it could grow that long. Maybe she just never wore underwear. I do not know. So thank you guys so much for watching. Those were our weird and crazy vagina facts. The uh, potato one was definitely the weirdest. Potato one was definitely the weirdest to me too. Let us know down below which one that you guys thought was the craziest. And also make sure to smash this video a thumbs up. If we could get it to 30,000 thumbs ups, then the first 30,000 people to give it a thumbs up We'll get money somehow. Don't you want money? I want money. I mean, who doesn't want money? And subscribe if you're not already. Also, follow us on Instagram. I'm trying to reach 70,000 Instagram followers. Whoop, whoop. Mwah. And bye, guys.